beauty with this one, as opposed to the Mark II having it replaced, this is now 345 brake horsepower all-wheel drive. You've got three driving modes, you've got the normal mode when you start up the engine, you can go on to sports mode, a bit more responsive on your steering, track mode, which is what it says, very stiff on the suspension again, and you've got the new drift button, which puts a bit more power to the rear wheels, you can set the car out, have a little play with it, have a bit of fun. you've got a choice of seating. It comes with the standard ST seats or you can have the optional extra the shell seats. Um, other extras you can have on, choice of wheels, choice of colours. This particular colour is a brand new colour only available on the Mark 3 RS. Nitrous blue, really nice colour, very popular colour with sales. Well we're about to go for a drive in the new Ford RS so looking forward to that, really excited. Heard lots about it so we'll see what it's like. It just flew sort of not to smiles in zero second or something like that. It was amazing. We had it in uh, the sport mode, so we was crackling, popping, shooting down the road. Absolutely amazing. Four wheel drive, you know, testing that out. The car was absolutely glued to the road. It was not going anywhere. First focus I've driven, if I'm honest, but um, so to drive, drive the RS, my first focus is pretty, pretty good. I uh, found it really well. I mean, it's. it's, it's goes like anything. Power delivery is good, um, nice and quiet as well. Um, so I think it's the best of both worlds really, you get a family car and if you want that bit more you get a bit of power as well. So Previously I had the ST, um, so no that's the first time I drove the RS. Uh, very impressed, very impressed yeah. Really good positive feel truck steering, superb brakes. Um, yeah the car felt really good, handling was you know really really good chassis. Uh, very quiet up road, um, but yeah, its biggest downfall for me was just the lack of power. However, it did pull strong all the way from 2000 all the way through the red range. I've already had a test drive, and it's in sport mode. It's good, but it's, it's if you don't put it in sport mode, it's just like driving anything else. But as soon as you hit that sport button, it starts banging and crackling. It lies from zip up a lot. It's something that you could have as a day-to-day -day car as well as a track car. It's a little bit more refined. I think um, interior is obviously newer. It's just um, it, it's it's the next stage of, of the car, really. So it, it's just it's just brilliant. It's made a big help with the four-wheel drive. It's really helped the car, definitely for me. Someone who's had a Mark II before, front-wheel drive. It was absolutely the limit of a front-wheel drive car. It's like glued to ground. It's you know no understeer, oversteer. You put it in a corner and it goes where you point it. It's it's amazing. 